What's up dudes and dudes and you're not my name's Heather today we're gonna be playing some Intrepid Izzy Devs actually requested me to play this game before the Kickstarter was over and I just made it because the Kickstarter is almost done So if at any point you think that this game is actually something you would be like worth funding in the Kickstarter Links are gonna be in the description for all of that and who doesn't want to already end up funding a game that's got a Kermit the Frog in a top hat like look at how elegant it is Good day, madam, and welcome to the demo. Thanks, Mr. Frog. Please be aware that this demo is merely a preview of a work in development. Sure, I get it, bye. Goodbye, madam, and good luck. Okay, how do I actually jump? It's a good thing that the game is like very self-explanatory. Why is my jump button my kick button at the same time? I don't, I don't, ha 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 I got super punches. You ready for this? Yeah, you stupid plants. I'm ready to fight all of you. What are these weird enemies dude? Like seriously, they're scaring me huh? All the crystals are mine. How do we actually do this? Oh my goodness. Are you kidding me? Ah, ah, we made it just like Sanic would have always wanted me to oh my goodness Did I just get some crazy? Why am I fighting a bunch of plants dude? Apparently there's a couple different combos you're gonna be able to do in the game too like uh, you know, Hadouken and uh, th that move. Yeah, there we go. The Hadouken. Okay. Uh, otherwise, I can always just do it with. Oh, I'm dead. Because enemies touch you and you just get hit in one shot and you're dead. Huh. That's cool. Loading level. I was already just here, so thank you very much. Oh, I have to grab all the crystals all over again. I guess that means that I'm just not going to bother grabbing them all. And I'm also not going to bother attacking every single enemy in the game because what's the point? And if we go up top. Do we have to go up top? We really have to go up top. Dude, seriously, that's not cool. I don't want to go up here. I'm just going to end up dying again. Like seriously, take this you stupid plant. Hadouken, I got you. I got you all. Hadouken, that doesn't actually phase through them and we ended up getting stun locked. That's not really cool game. Ah! I like how she, I think she's actually even saying Hadouken. Well, so long as you're a little bit more strategic like I just was, Ha! <sighs> then, of course, you're going to be able to get through that. No problemo! Die, weird secret! Huh. I said, huh. I'm sli- Okay, why can't I slide? No, I didn't want to do that. Huh. How did I do that slide move? How do I do that? Oh, there we go. Now I've got it. Okay, because the jump button for some reason is like the attack button at the same time. Why do I have minus one life? I don't think I actually do. I think I just have one life. Uh, and it just has a minus symbol. Damn! Okay. Okay. We're good. We're good. This game's pretty cool, though. I'm actually surprised at the production value of it. Like, seriously. It's really, really neat. Indie games are really taking the cake, aren't they? Like, seriously. How do I get up there? Oh, my goodness. That was a close one. Huh! Yeah, she actually does say Hadouken, which is hilarious. I don't know if they can get away with that, but they... Well, they are. Uh, can we actually move this box, by the way? Yes, we definitely can. And I gotta be careful because my jump attack would probably end up throwing me into it uh, and destroying it, right? Like, like this. Yes, that's exactly what I meant to do. I don't think, Hadouken, I don't think I could jump up there if my life depended on it. What are you? Hadouken, okay, I can't even hurt that guy. Ugh! The spikes, they hurt my face. Dude, that's not cool. Why did I roll into them? Okay, that's like really, really cryptic and tricky to do. So instead, I'm going to hit these. What the? This is so crazy, dude. What's happening? What the? Magic mirror, take me away to the chocolate mine or never mind. Chocolate mine, you say? Chocolate raisin. No, really, what, what's going on? Loading level? Why do pixel games need to load nowadays? That's something I really don't get. Are you evil mushrooms? Die! Oh my goodness, we've got Scorpion, Scorpion Kings. <gasps> oh! Okay, well that didn't really end up working now, did it? How do we actually get to that key, you ask? I don't know, well, there's probably like a double jump feature or something. Hadouken! Excuse me? How do we actually fight that guy? Ah, like this! Yes! Just as I planned! Can I Hadouken up in the air? No, I don't see, it doesn't seem like I can. Yeah! Take that stupid head! I still don't really know how I'm supposed to double jump or anything. Aha, a perfectly safe looking contraption that would bring me safely down safely. Eep! I'm fine. I couldn't get that chest. Cool, vampire fashion. Excuse me? 
Ooh, you get different costumes. I didn't know that. That's pretty cool. Die, weirdo. Like, seriously, get out of my face. That's awesome, dude. You know what this game's desperately missing, though? Health. Like, where? how, how do I get health, dude? I'm like almost dead. I've got one hit this entire time and I'm probably going to die like right here at these spikes because of the fact that I can't see anything. Like man alive. Is there a secret over here? Aha! I like this though. This game's actually really well done outside of the fact that I don't, don't have any health. Like I'm at one hit game. Seriously, like just give me some health, please. Otherwise vampire girl here is gonna get it. Is that health? Is that health? Ha! Yes, it definitely was. Awesome! Okay, so health is secretly out in the world. It's kind of like Castlevania or something. What the? Oh, that was really interesting. So when I cast my Hadouken, uh, it ended up actually like casting and destroying the block in front of us. Or no, it's not that. Aha! We actually have ah, a different ability because our costume's different. That's interesting and cool, isn't it? I like it. I like it a lot. Stupid game! So that means that we... Wait, does that mean we have a double jump with the vampire suit? Maybe. No, we don't have a double jump. Vampire fashion. <laughs> I just got it all over again. Really? I... Okay. Really? I've got to go all the way over here and hit the stupid switch again? Well, you know what? At least now we know for sure my health is... Uh, or my extra lives are at minus two. So maybe you just have infinite extra lives like on the demo or something. I don't really know. This game would be really interesting to see people speed run though, I think. Just because you kind of have to be like really, really careful with everything, right? But man alive, dude, that is like not fair. Like enemies on platforms are just gross because there's not really any way that I can end up casting my ult like right away. And and I just die by these guys. Like, ha 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 ha, this is so difficult for all the wrong reasons. <sighs> well, anyways, get out of here, stupid. Oh, that's right, I forgot. I'm not supposed to jump there. Ha 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 ha. Because the jumping in this game is not one of those where it's like, tap the jump button and you jump less higher than if you end up holding the jump button. Let me see if I can end up getting through this part without dying this time. Okay, here we go, let's see. So what happens if I lure him? Okay, I see how it is. So if you end up attacking the enemy, it stuns them uh, out, of their, out of their attack animation. Okay, so we just gotta play it nice and safe is the whole thing. Let's just get rid of that idiot. And then, ha! Jump kick of destiny. Oh my goodness gracious, I can't believe I ended up actually making that. How do we actually get up there? Oh, we can't because again, we don't have a jump attack button. Why would I want, oh, I could have pushed that. Oh no, I could have put that somewhere else and it would have been a lot more useful. There's where we end up using the key that we can't get. Oh, wait a minute. Here's where we get a key. How do we, there's all these like special abilities that we don't have. How am I supposed to do this stuff? That's not the button. What the? Why can I use telekinetic ability to shift the camera out of my way? What the? Ooh, look at that. No, I want to do this. Oh, well, I see that key up there. I just can't really get anything for some reason. Rah! All right, let's get out of here. Magic mirror, take me away. Yup. I don't care. Aztec Greece. Is this the first level again? Uh... It is, and it's all the way back at the beginning. Starting to notice a very strange trend with this game. Like, I, I like this game, don't get me wrong. It's got the production, it looks really cool. We gotta reopen that door? Like, really? Okay, fine. Oh, and uh, for some reason, I guess I killed those enemies way too quickly uh, that were spawning up here because um, now we can't do anything and now it's just a game over. <laughs> so it's still uh, again like it's a cool game it is but it's not without its flaws uh, it is a Kickstarter demo though so of course it's going to end up being broken in most regards that's usually what ends up happening with these but you would expect that it would be pretty ironed out uh, you know it, it, I, I know that it, as far as like game design is concerned it's really difficult to end up 
capturing and fixing all of the different variables in the game, especially if not many people are playing the demo and actually giving them feedback. So I'm sure they'll end up probably fixing it if they ever end up actually watching this video like the devs or anything. But in any case, folks, it still is a cool game. It still is something that I personally do think should end up getting fully funded to being a full release because it's got the production, you know, and like I said, indie games are just like, it, like it feels really good on the controller i think this would be a great game to end up coming out on consoles maybe even just a nice little game to come out on the switch but in order for that a level of portability if it would end up coming on the switch it means that you'd have to be able to pause and save at like every section or something like that like the checkpoints definitely need to be a little bit more improved uh before the game would end, end up actually coming out but in any case Thank you for watching. Links are in the description for everything about this game. Don't forget to like, share, favorite, and subscribe for more daily content as well as building up loyalty points for my merch store. Links are in the description for that where you can pick up this shirt and a bunch of others. Sign or and stay epic, everybody.